All right, lads, BSP are you? Big Sip Beer Review. In today's review, we're going to look at this coffee and chocolate stout. It's from Arbor Brewery in Bristol, and it's called Café Creme. 6.9% in a 440ml can. I done an unboxing video, or a deboxing video, I like to call it, <laughs> um, yesterday or day before, one of the days, and um, you would have seen me unbox this, and I did um, say that the beer crony absolutely adores this, so that was one of the reasons I bought it, to see how good it is. Um, I know it's been stocked in Marks and Spencers, but we only got a small one um, in Newport, so I did go have a look, and it wasn't there, so I have been looking to get my hands on this for a while. So let's have a look at it. Café Creme by Arbor, coffee and chocolate stout. Oh my God, I mean, just cracked that and I just had a waft of oh, lovely coffee. <laughs> Arbor in Bristol, so poor, poor. Um, yeah, we've got plans to go um, to the brewery when everything gets back to normal. Um, we're going to have a weekend in Bristol because the craft beer scene down there is just superb. So many um, breweries down there all doing little bits. So we're planning uh, a weekend in Bristol. A couple of boys. Big sip paw paw. Um, yeah, so Arbor is on the um, it's on the list and it's on the to-do list. A big sip paw paw. But with jet black in colour. Absolutely pitch black. And you cannot... Not see nothing through that. There's no light coming through here whatsoever. And the aroma. Wow. As soon as I cracked that can open, I had a massive waft of coffee. And this. That smells amazing. It does. A slight bit of. um, It is a slight bit of chocolate as well, but. You've got to try and work for that. Well, you've, got, you've got to work for that. It is mainly coffee. Freshly ground coffee. That smells incredible. You only walk past a, um, a coffee shop on the high street and you've got that massive, you've got a waft of coffee, the coffee shop. Wow, that's what that smells like. It smells really, really good. Hopefully it tastes as well as that smells. Got a little bit more left in that can, but we'll get them all in. So yeah, that's a good looking stout. We got a, I say a two finger mocker head. Chin chin, oh buddy, let's have a go. <laughs> oh, it's incredible. That is absolutely incredible. I can't believe how good this smells. It's really, really good and really, really nice aroma. Oh, wow. Nice, smooth mouthfeel. On the aroma, it is a lot of um, ground coffee. But on the tastes, there is ground coffee on there, but it's a lot more chocolate. On the aroma, we, we want to try and work out if it was chocolate coming through. It was a little bit of chocolate coming through on the, on the aroma, but on the tastes, it is more chocolate than ground coffee. There's coffee there. It is coffee there, but mainly um, mainly chocolate, and that is lingering as well. It is a really, really long lasting flavors on the stout as well. It's right what the crony said. That is incredible. He raves about it, and when someone raves about the drink, and they talk and talk and talk the drink up, you. Gotta try it to see why, um, see if if it's true or not. And gotta agree, he's bang on, absolutely banging stout. Ah, oh. 
Yeah, that's incredible. Let's have a look at the Big Sit Bolton ability. That's really good. Um, Norse Star by Northern Monk. That was incredible, I found. Um, I can't remember the rating I give that, but that was really good. I think that edges it. I think that beats it, slightly beats it. Um, I'm going to give it a big sip rate. I'm going to be a 9.5 out of 10. The reason I'm going to give it a 9.5 out of 10 is because I've reviewed the vocations... Chocolate and cherry imperial Kirsch stout, and that was a ten out of ten. That was the best I've ever tasted in my life. So it's not quite as good as that, but that is still incredible. Cheers, lads! More reviews to come on a future date. Big sip. Ah.